Olympic Tractor Power fans, this video comes to you from a Western Kentucky field where a J.I. Case 2594 tractor is planting corn with a Kinsey 3500-815 planter. That means that the planter is capable of planting 20 feet of 8-row 30-inch space corn or 15 rows of 15-inch spaced soybeans. This video will share the production history, specifications, and original price tag of the Case 2594. Viewers will also have an opportunity to see what it's like to sit in the operator's seat of this 180 PTO horsepower tractor as it's planting corn. But first, let's head out to the field to see and hear this great classic tractor from the 1980s at work. J.I. Case introduced the 2594 tractor as its top-end high-horsepower row crop tractor with the launch of the all-new 94 series of row crop tractors in 1983. The tractor was manufactured at the company's Racine, Wisconsin manufacturing plant through 1987. During its first two years of production, it had the Case name on the hood and was painted white with black trim. In November of 1984, Tenneco, the parent company of J.I. Case, acquired International Harvester's Agricultural Division. The new company was named Case International, and moving forward, all of the 94 series tractors were painted in Harvester Red with black trim. Spotting a J.I. Case white and black 2594 at work in the field is a rare sight as a majority of the tractors were manufactured under the Case International label in red. This tractor is powered by a Case 8.3 liter 504 cubic inch turbocharged diesel engine rated at 180 PTO horsepower. Two different transmissions were available on the tractor. The first was a three-speed power shift with 12 forward and three reverse speeds. The second transmission option is a four-speed power shift with 24 forward and three reverse speeds. Customers ordering the four-speed power shift transmission would add $2,703 to the price tag. 
The tractor is fitted with an 85-gallon diesel fuel tank and weighs in from the factory at 14,875 pounds and can be field weighted up to 16,220 pounds. The original price tag for this tractor in 1984 was $65,791. Here is the Case 2594's cab from the operator's perspective. You can see that this tractor has digital information displays on the dashboard. This was new technology for the 1980s with tractors moving away from traditional gauges to a digital display that was computerized to help the operator to get more information on how the tractor was performing in the field. I hope that you've enjoyed spending some time out in the field with this Case 2594 tractor. And if you'd like to see more videos like this one, consider subscribing to Big Tractor Power YouTube, where there's over 1,000 videos of farm machines in action. If you've enjoyed the content of this video, consider giving it a thumbs up, as it helps alert other tractor fans on YouTube that the video is here and available to watch. Make sure to click on the notifications bell as well, so you'll know when the next Big Tractor Power video is released. New videos are coming out almost every day from the channel. If you have any questions or thoughts about this video, please leave them in the comment section below as I try to respond to every post that is made. If you would like to get a preview of what is coming up next on Big Tractor Power YouTube, make sure to check out Big Tractor Power Instagram where I share pictures and short video clips of what is currently being filmed in the field. As always, thank you for watching.